Well, Manchester United came into this knowing a win would take them top. Tottenham needed to stop their run of six defeats in a row in the WSL. Manchester United have most of possession in the first half and the better chances. Slick Orton shooting over. Out by Zellam Russo with a little touch. This is a fine ball that sent Galton away and with her pace she got there. Ahead of Zadorsky but fired over. She was onside there. She's offside here as Manchester United thought they'd taken the lead. On a battle with the ball in. Galton creeping between defenders in off the post but I think she knew straight away she was off. It is tight. She just leans forward. At the other end, we saw very little from Spurs attacking. But this is a fine pass by Ashley Neville to put Beth England through a well timed run. And you would bank on her hitting the target. In there, alert. Waiting for the ball to come through. There's the run. Never with the vision. No execution. Nikita de Paris. Nikita Paris did so well there into the second half. Tune off the post. Manchester United starting the second period really well. Moving the ball quicker. Paris pulled into the side to do just this. off the upright the breakthrough finally came the ball into the box created all the danger with Paris and Russo leaping and it dropped to Leah Galton intelligent run by Backley was strong all game long the two forwards did their business Tottenham left one to jump with two and they were ball watching as it drops here to Galton Manchester United were ahead, not for long. Nine minutes later, Iwabuchi, the quick free kick, sends Beth England away. Shouldn't score from there. Does. Brilliant effort. 1-1. First Tottenham player to score in three WSL games in a row. First Tottenham player to score in three WSL games in a row and lose them all. It was a fine finish. So powerful as a runner. So determined and focused. She knows what she wants to do. Step inside. Bang. A minute and 21 seconds later though. Manchester United were back ahead. Zellum with the ball. This is a good run from the substitute. With Thea Garcia. And Marley Bartrick. Thinking perhaps that Amy Turner behind her was a Manchester United player. Absolutely lashed it beyond Corpola. It's the only thing I can think about. Loses her bearings. Knows Gorton is in there somewhere. Make sure she gets there first, but goodness me. What a horrible own goal. This was the moment that jeopardised Manchester United's lead. A little bit of a feisty combination between Blundell and Ayan. And then Toon on Sumanen who pinned her legs, Toon reacted. The question is, does she make contact with the face of the Tottenham player? Off she goes, but Manchester United held on to win 2-1 and go top of the table.